Live Storm Tracker Doppler Radar, sponsored by bankruptcy attorney E. Orem Young. Now, your local weather with meteorologist Brian Briggs. Well, good Tuesday to you. Hopefully your day has been warm. And a lot of us have been really cold out there, and it's been very, very soggy, and especially up north. Depending on where you've been today, you've either seen rain or you've either seen snow as the system has pushed through the Arklamis. And here's the radar, at least at this time. Notice that most of the rain at least has been in, in uh, Louisiana here. But as you get into southern Arkansas, notice the pinks, blues showing up. And uh, through the majority of the day, those folks have been seeing at least some sort of sleet and freezing rain here. So as we go into the remainder the evening notice it is starting to kind of push off here towards the east with our eastern counties seeing that best chance for, for the next uh, few hours or so as the system pushes through but accumulations generally have been light and that's due to warm road temperatures across the vast majority of the Arklamis. We're seeing above freezing conditions pretty much everywhere but we're starting to see cooler road conditions off towards the north and uh, so there might be some slick spots but that's why we just really haven't seen much of the way of accumulation at least in uh, those parts of the Arklamis. So uh, again uh, for the course of tonight, live storm tracker Doppler radar brought to you by Eorm Young showing where that chunk of precipitation is. And again, uh, we're going to be seeing that continuing here for uh, the next uh, little bit or so. So again, um, let's see here. I want to get right on the graphic that I'm thinking about. That being said, current temperatures have been in the lower to middle 30s across the uh, southern Arkansas sections, upper 30s along I-20 and uh, lower 40s off towards the south. And a very, very big difference from where we were at this time yesterday as those temperatures have changed quite a bit. We're seeing at least a 30 degree temperature change across the vast majority of the Arklamis. So the question is, where are we going to go from here tonight? Well, Future Tracker continues to push the uh, remainder of the precipitation off into Mississippi through the course of the night tonight. And uh, by about 7 or so o'clock, that's when it should wrap up at least the frozen precip. Should have a few showers lingering into southeastern sections of the Arklamis by the time we get to the 9 and 10 o'clock shows tonight. And then we'll eventually clear out. Skies will clear. Cold air, though, sticks around. And uh, it's going to be a very chilly night and um, could even be dealing with a little bit of black ice. So for tonight, going to be dropping down to about 30 degrees. And again, those clouds will eventually clear out through the course of the night. We'll expect to see middle to upper 20s in southern Arkansas, upper 20s to lower 30s along I-20 and then pretty much uh, lower 30s down south. So again, especially for folks north of I-20, keep your eye out as you uh, head out the door tomorrow morning. So there could be a few patches of those black ice as we have a lot of moisture around and uh, very cool temperatures. So for tomorrow, getting into the upper 50s, the good news is we will have lots of sunshine once uh, this system moves out and, uh, and we'll start a warming trend as uh, we head into next week. So the seven-day forecast shows that uh, weather will remain quiet here as we get into the second week into the weekend and uh, temperatures will eventually rebound into the middle 60s and then ahead of our next system gets here for uh, Monday and then we'll see temperatures dropping a little bit with that and the rain will return as well but uh, all in all as uh, if you just didn't like today's weather it's not gonna be sticking around for too much longer so I know it uh, at least put us a little bit into the uh, Christmas spirit here as you know just enough of that uh, snow to you know get it really nice outside and there's a live look at our uh, lit Christmas tree up in El Dorado Arkansas so Again, you can see the dark clouds still there, but they're kind of getting out of that precip here. But uh, folks, I even heard some reports up there getting a little bit of sleet and snow in that part of the Arklamis as well. So a nice little taste, and uh, we'll take it. Yeah, we'll take it, but be super careful out there. Black ice yes. is nothing to yes, mess with. Yes, very much so. It's this ice you can't literally see. So, yeah, just be very, very careful. All right. Thankfully, it's not yep. sticking around for too long. Oh, yeah. Thanks, Brian. All right, guys, still ahead on health, a new treatment. Recently